I just got married. This is my first marriage. I am 37. I should have done that. Like I'm way, like I'm way behind. Like I should have a divorce under my belt. You know, like a failed engagement. Like I should, I should be like, wow, well, I'm in foreclosure too. I have nothing. I have nothing. You guys. I have a two-bedroom apartment, and I'm proud. You know what I mean? And when we go out, like we go out sometimes. Me and my husband sometimes we go to the grocery store. Like that's fun. so it's crazy, right? Uh, we go to Ralph's. You know, and we're at Ralph's, and this old white lady comes up to us, and she looks at him, and she goes, "Can I ask you a question about him? That may sound offensive." And I said, "Absolutely." <laughs> And she goes, does he play basketball? I was like, that is not what I thought you were doing. <laughs> I was like, no, he doesn't, man, but he's a huge dick. <laughs> Get out of there. I was like, would we be able to get a Ralph's if you play basketball? <laughs> no. We'd be at Whole Foods. <laughs> Love Whole Foods, right? So expensive. <laughs> I go to Trader Joe's because it's like the poor man's Whole Foods, right? It's like the broke ass Whole Foods, right? Like, oh, I will buy something from the toiletries because I can afford it, right? <laughs> like a rock star. Even though I, I hate it, like I love it and I hate it. Like I love Trader Joe's and I hate it. Maybe I hate the parking lots. Hate those. Hate the parking lots. I'll walk 10 blocks down, I forget my bags. They're judgy. You notice that if you forget your bags? You know, like, did you forget your bags? No, I didn't. No, I didn't. And I walked 10 blocks, so. Just give me a goddamn paper bag. <laughs> I didn't, because I would kill somebody, and I saved a life. Because I didn't kill somebody in a terrible parking lot. Why does everything about Trader Joe's rock except your parking lot? And, and by the way, did you notice people lost their minds with the 10 cent thing? I saw like an 85 year old man. Like, they're like, do you want to buy a bag? No, put it in the car. I'm like, I will carry dimes. I'll be like Robin Hood. You know, it's like, here's a bag. Here's a bag. I'm like, come on. Come on! Dimes everywhere! I'll bring a roll and just help senior citizens in. Why? You can't make it to your car, sir. It locks. Car, right? He's like, mm -mm. it locks. Sir, let me help you. Buy a bag. They're so happy there, too. It's like, um, it's like a musical. You walk in, they're like, oh, turn it. Like they, I'm like, what the hell? Why are they so happy? Why? Okay, first of all, nobody's saying something. I'm gonna say it. Two buck chunk is not two bucks anymore. Anybody want to know? Can you address this? It's two fifty, right? And it's not any better. It's not like they put a better label on it. So you're like, oh, is this? Oh, this is Charles Shaw. They must have gotten. No, it's two fifty now, right? And that express lane, they have an express lane that says, oh, you know, twelve items or less, give or take one or two items. No, no, no. Where I'm from, I'm from New York. It's 12, it's 12 or less. No give or take, okay? And you people with your bunches of bananas, that's five items. I count, I'm a counter. I count, I don't care. I decided to do some research too. I went up to um, one of the trade room workers and I said, um, can, I, can I ask you a question? And he goes, sure, what, what do you need? I was like, I just wanna ask, why are you guys so happy that we're here? Like, why? You know what he said to me? They don't drug test. <laughs> Why are we not working there, everybody? We're gonna be on ecstasy right now. With a job. With a job. <laughs>